Oh, hey. Welcome to my room. Let me give you a tour. Okay. First things first, don't look at my face, okay? I haven't uploaded anything since last year because my skin has had the worst breakout I've ever had in my whole entire life. I'll put pictures on the screen, but like, you can still, it's still in the process of going away. Like you can still see all the redness and stuff. Listen, I just got on medication for it. So it's just calming down now, but it's still very much there. So I'm just gonna stay back here and you can look at my walls uh, and not me. Okay, this is my door. This is my door. My room is the whole basement, by the way. I live in a three bedroom house and four people need bedrooms in the house and I refuse to share with my sisters. So I'm like, okay, basement is mine. So the entirety of our basement besides this, you have this, those are the stairs, and then the whole basement is mine. Right here is the laundry room. We're not gonna go in there because it's not my room. And being in the basement, Everyone, everyone just barges in. Everyone just barges into my room to go to the laundry room. And they're not even like, they don't even knock. Like what if I'm right here? My mirror's over here. So what if I'm like getting naked changing? You can see me. Painted this myself with acrylic paint. I don't know what this is. I got this on a family trip um, when I was in my April era. And then I also have a keychain that says It says the C word. I don't think I'm allowed to say it on YouTube. My sister made this. Shout out to Clara, she sells them, so it stays there. And then over here, this is my shoe rack from Amazon. Almost everything in my room is from Amazon, so like if I don't say where something is from, it's most likely from Amazon. These are all of my shoes that I use, that, like my main shoes, you know, like the shoes I wear the most. Fake Doc Martens here, they're really only here because they're covering up a coffee stain, because I stained my wall, it doesn't come off. Let me, let me give you a close up, coffee stain. And then these are all the shoes that I wear the most. And then I have my shark slippers. And then this, I saw someone do this on Pinterest and I was like, oh, I need, I need something to go right here. So I did it even though I have no pairs of sunglasses that I actually wear. I don't wear any of these. All my pictures that I have on my walls, I get them from Pinterest and then I just print them off at Walmart. Except for these. They all had cases like this. I got them from Amazon um, in like 2018. And then I dropped them all and the glass shattered for the case on these two. So now I just have one in a frame. I don't know, it, it kind of looks stupid. Um, these are some dance awards that I have, routine of the day, highest mark, highest mark stuff. This is the first trophy I've ever gotten. It's broken. I had to hot glue it back together. I made all these little stars. I think they're pretty cute. I just painted on a piece of paper and just cut out star shapes um, because I am very far from a minimalist. I will not accept blank space on my wall. And then this is this is my little coffee station. This is also my dresser. Um, you can't really open any of these drawers because they're packed with clothes and they all open at once. Because um, I have too many clothes and I will not get rid of them because I do wear them all. I change my clothes like five times a day because sometimes I just feel dirty and I just need to change. Like this is my third outfit today and it's 3 p.m. Anyways. This is my Keurig machine where I make my coffees. I have my coffee pods. I have some medium roast. I have dark roast. I have I have light roast. Anything that you need right here. Oh, I have my incense. Should we light some? Should we set the mood? painting um, and this is a fake plant I don't have any real plants in my room because I will kill them they will all die and then I'll feel bad and then cry about it because I killed a plant and I don't want to do that so I have fake plants then I have my little coffee signs and then wall filler things now if we if we move along over here this is my mirror these headphones don't work they're here for display this mirror is where I take all my um, outfit pictures, you know, selfies. I only take mirror selfies. I, you'll never catch me. I don't do that. Um, down here, this is my painting bucket. There's some unfinished paint. Actually, don't look at that. I don't want anyone to look at that. Unfinished paintings in here, paints, paint brushes, my painting apron. This shit, I've had this since 2019. 
Wow, quite the masterpiece. My best artwork to date, to be honest. And so we actually don't look behind this mirror because there's seven bags and a dehumidifier back here. They're all filled with something. Uh, I could not tell you with what. Uh, what's in this one? Oh, that's my yarn for my crocheting. Here are my pads for my skateboard. It doesn't matter and no one cares. This is from Amazon and they actually sent me the wrong one, but I never returned it because I didn't want to, I didn't want to go through the process. I really didn't care that much. Sorry about my giant window. It's probably making the lighting real bad, but this is my record player stand. Do I have any records that I actually listen to? No, they're all from the thrift store for decoration. You see, in 2020, when I decided to up my music taste from One Direction, that was about all I listened to. Um, I was like, ooh, I'm gonna get a record player. I'm gonna listen to all of these indie artists. Like, it's gonna be so cute. And then I never used it. I never bought any records because turns out they're expensive. Here we have a souvenir from Cuba that my mom got me. And then we have Sage. Oh my God, I'm falling over. Here, this wall with my window. Well, I like this wall, okay? It's, well, it's just book pages. This is a painting I did. The book that is ripped off, what is the book? Percy Jackson, The Lightning Thief. I had two copies of this book, so I ripped up one and I stuck it onto my wall and I like it. Uh, it did physically pain me to rip out the pages from the book, but I had two copies, so what was I supposed to do with the other one, you know? These are all my movie posters. I find these on Pinterest, I type up La La Land movie Polaroid poster and then it comes up. You can do that with like any movie ever. This is just a holder. I don't, I think I got that at the dollar store maybe. Same with that plant. That plant's like probably from the dollar store. It's fake again. Um, and this is my couch from Walmart. It's really old. <laughs> this couch is from 2016, babe. So I don't know where it's from. It's probably from Walmart though, if I were to guess. It's pretty cute, you know? I have Baratelli here. I have Grogu here. He's giant, very comfortable. I like to go like this sometimes. This is just a little, a little place to kick up your feet. Ooh, let me take a rest, you know? This is from, this I found at the thrift store. I don't know if you can tell. <laughs> hey! Okay, that hasn't happened before. Anyways, Candle took this from my sister's room. I have no idea what it smells like. Ass, it smells like ass. Um, and then this is a little rainbow light up sign. I don't have any batteries right now, so I can't show you, but it is pretty cute. And inside there, we don't have to talk about that. It's kind of a mess down here. Uh, basically, it was just whatever didn't have a place in my room. I just shoved um, under there. Here is my little music corner, kind of. Let me get a close up. Let me get a close up here of my music corner. This is my Umbrella Academy poster from Amazon. Everyone on TikTok loves this for some reason. I had it on my wall and then I would like dance in front of it and everyone's like, oh my God, Umbrella Academy poster. I don't know what that was about, but it's over here now. This, okay, this is my guitar tuner. This is my amplifier for my electric guitar. This is my good old acoustic guitar. She's old. <laughs> And she needs to be tuned apparently i don't listen clara had this one last this i don't know what this is either my mom got this for our bathroom and then it started to mold so she was gonna throw it away and i was like mm, no give it to me and then i bleached it like i cleaned all the mold off with bleach and then i stuck some rocks in there and added a few little dollar store plants if we look up a little bit let me get in here i have a mirror here that i've had since 2016. this is my disco ball Hey, I was kind of a genius for this. This is from the dollar store. My room is basically free promo for Amazon and the dollar store. These are my actual working headphones that I use every single day of my life because I love them so much and they're noise canceling. This is my beloved electric guitar. I got her her own stand this year. This is a new addition. Usually she would sit propped up against like my couch or something. Now she's on display for everyone to see. I love her. All my records and my CDs, like every single one in my room are also from the thrift store. So it's like, they're all, like these, I think have like a breath of snow and ashes. Like, I don't know what the f that is, okay? And sometimes it's fun to play these records on my record player. They play like old, like 60s songs and it's kind of funky and fun. This is my ukulele. I got that in like 2017 when I decided I was going to become a musician. And if ever I want to play that Lava, does anyone know that Lava Disney song? 
with like the volcanoes and they sing I love you. I love you. I play that on my ukulele. That's about it. I'm not usually a carpet kind of gal. I'm never a carpet kind of gal. I hate carpets. I hate them all. But then I found this. Is it from Sheen? Yeah. Is that my proudest moment ever? No, not at all. But nothing else was really tickling my fancy and my floor is disgusting and bare and maybe the ugliest wood shade ever. So I just needed to spice it up like just a little bit. And now we have her and I think she's kind of adorable and is it, it's a little childish I know, but like, I like it. These are all my shoes that I uh, don't really wear that much, but like also still wear occasionally. Anyways, this is my favorite wall, I think. This is my clothing rack from Amazon. I have my clothes assorted in a color... What am I trying to say? This is wrong! Anyways, clothing rack, rainbows. This is my Beatles poster. It's from Amazon also, big surprise. More posters, Spider-Man and The Last of Us. Guess where they're from? Amazon. And then, I don't know if you can see here, this plant holder is actually stuck between my school ceiling tiles because I have school ceiling tiles in my room. So I can't drill anything into the walls because it's foam. So I just like stick things in between the tiles. I just like shove things in there. So then like most of my vines, sometimes the tape doesn't stick. So I just like shove my vines in between the cracks. My vines are also all from Amazon, shocker. Then we have Hoser, Ho F off, I can never say this man's name. This man, I love him to bits. Can't say his goddamn name. And Noah Khan, uh, some of my favorite artists. And then we have Phoebe Bridgers and Bo Burnham. They're kind of, they're nice to each other. I thought that was kind of funny because you know, anyways, this is my jewelry holder. It's ugly as f but it does the job. I have my earrings, I have my necklaces, I have my bracelets, and then I have random stuff. Dude, I don't even know what's in here. Shoelaces, I use shoelaces as belts. Here's um, some Squishmallows. I am 18, um, and I do love my Squishmallows, and I put them on display for everyone to see. So, yeah. And then if you look right here, this is the only real plant in my room. Only real plant. It's a succulent, okay? You barely give them water, and they live forever. I've had this since 2021, though, so I'd say I'm doing a pretty good job. This table, dude, I don't even know. I have all my crystals. More thrift store plants, thrift store candles. I don't burn those because they don't smell good. I have a lot of rainbows in my room, okay? Yeah, I don't have anything else to say about that. This is my bookshelf. It holds books and more crystals and dust and fake plants from the dollar store. I have more crystals down there. This is, you don't need to know about this. I've kind of like just gotten into reading more like the last year or two, so I don't have like a shit ton of books, but we're gonna get there soon because the only thing I've been doing with my life recently is reading. Here's my desk. Can you even see with this big ass chair going? Like? Here's my desk. Don't look at the wires down here. But you can't see them when the chair is here, so just like ignore them. But this is my desk where I sit 90% of the day. This is the world's uh, grossest monitor. It's old and it's dusty. Oh my God, I forgot I had a coffee. <laughs> I've been putting honey in my coffee lately. Oh my God, life-changing. I have like raw honey and it tastes so good. And I put some in my coffee. It's so good. Anyways, this is a coaster that I crocheted myself. I don't know why I made it white. Don't ask me why I made it white because the only thing I put on this is coffee. You probably can't tell. It's only slightly staining just a little bit. This desk is a new addition. It is from... That's a great question. I don't know where it's from. My mom got it for me for Christmas. But if I had to guess, Walmart. And this is my crowded ass organizer thing. I have a mini Grogu. I crocheted this. I'm in the process of crocheting a Mandalorian too. So then they're gonna be pals. Anyways, skincare, which I haven't been able to use since I've been on my goddamn medication for my skin. They're like, yeah, just use water. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean just use water? So I've been going insane just a little bit. Uh, this is where I eat my meals when I'm not having a family dinner. I pull out my tray, I pull out my Cody Co and I eat here. Usually I would sit on my chair. Right now I'm doing a little sewing project, so that's what's here. So just don't look at that. Here's one of my favorite things in my room. Are you ready? Are you ready for it? This whole bag is filled with chapstick um, because my lips are addicted to moisture. I have the driest lips maybe on the planet and I go through a chapstick every two weeks. So this is my stock for the year. And then this, this is a wall, Maze Runner poster. 
Billie Eilish poster. Map. I don't know why there's a map there. I got it in 2021. All from Amazon. This is my sign that says with peace and love. That's a quote from uh, Ringo Starr from the Beatles. I'm warning you with peace and love, but I have too much to do. So no more fan mail. Thank you. Thank you. And no objects to be signed. Nothing. Uh, anyway, peace and love, peace and love. With peace and love. I say it all the time. Uh, this is my fake plant, another one. This poster? Wow, I have a lot of Grogu in my room. Hey guys, do you think I like The Mandalorian? Just a question. That's from the dollar store. This tapestry is from Amazon, also. So, based off what we've seen so far, guess my favorite color. Mm, you're probably wrong, it's not green, it's red. My favorite color is actually red, but my whole room is green. And then we have my bed. Oh. oh, I'm missing a pillow! Oh my god, my other pillow is upstairs. So picture there's two pillows here. There's two pillows that sit on my bed and then there's four more pillows that sit underneath my bed because I don't have a green pillowcase for them. I never make my bed because in my mind, I'm like, okay, I wake up, I do my things, I go back to sleep. So what's the point of making my bed if I'm just gonna get in it again and ruin it, you know? But I made it for this video, so. And I make it sometimes when I'm like, when I'm like, you know, sometimes you get those that motivation squirt, no. Sometimes I get a like surge of motivation to just become a better person and not be a lazy f So then I'll be like, yeah, I make my bed every morning. And then I give up after like three days. I kind of just threw my blankets on here. This is a fuzzy blanket. This is a weighted blanket. Best thing of my life. I feel like I'm getting a warm hug every night when I go to sleep. I actually don't do a lot of sleeping here though because I have insomnia. So usually my night times look like I don't sleep much. These things, Amazon. I've had these for like five years, which is why they're not white anymore. And then I painted this record from the thrift store because it was red and it didn't match the vibe at all. Um, I have my skateboarding helmet there because I didn't know where else to put it. And then I have the rest of my Squishmallows there because I don't like them on my bed because I don't sleep with them. So I would just have to like throw them off the bed and then they'd just be on my floor because I don't make my bed again. So instead they're just up here. And then I'll bring you for a close up on my nightstand here. Usually I'd have the book that I'm reading right here, uh, but it's upstairs right now. And this, my mom got this for me. It's like you put it in between the two bait. Okay, this is, this is the book, ready? This is page number one, this is page number two. You put it like this so you can hold your book like this and you don't have to like worry about the pages like falling over. Anyways, cool thing. Um, I have my Aquaphor lifesaver, love her. My lamp that I use when I read at nighttime. And this is my little clock. Hey, she's kind of cute. She's from Amazon. A uh, little statue. This is my... I got this vase. Um, but everyone said that it looked like something that I probably can't say on YouTube. But you can use your imagination, you know? Like, anyways. I also broke it when I was putting the rocks in here. Because I was dropping the rocks in here. And I forgot that this is glass. So I cracked it, obviously. Because rocks would crack glass. So I just put tape there. And then I put little plants in from the dollar store. This sign lights up, but it is um, stuck to my table with sticky tack because it keeps falling over. Anyways, I think my nightstand's pretty cute. And here we have more music things, all printed from, <laughs> I feel claustrophobic. All printed from Walmart, found them on Pinterest. This, more, I literally, this wall that goes down here, I hate it, it's my least favorite wall. But I, I like, this is the one I redid like 10 times and I just could not figure out what to do. I was done in the end and I was just like, okay, f it, I'm, I'm sticking more book pages on here because I liked it over there, but it just kind of looks bad. Anyways, this is my TV. I don't want it here, <laughs> but it's mounted on the wall and I can't move it now. So rest of this wall, I have my laundry basket. This thing is always filled because as I said, I change my outfit like five times a day. So it's always like a big laundry mount in here. This tapestry or tapis tapestry, I don't know how you say it, but it's... It's from Amazon. I also have like, I have a stool here cause I don't know what to do with it. So it just kind of, it's just there. So like if anyone just wants to like sit here and talk to me while I don't sleep on my bed. I have some dance awards here cause um, I'm proud of my accomplishments. So I put them on my wall. And it, but it like doesn't match the vibe of anything at all. But I, I wanted them up because like, aren't these the cutest thing ever? Instead of trophies, they're records. That's awesome. I want it on my wall, but like, it doesn't really match, but I don't care. The last stop, this little thing here. This was like, I was like, I don't know what the f*** to do with this because it's like, 
So this is my Greek mythology shrine. I have my longboard, I have my skateboard. These are all pictures that I printed off and then I made these little things, quotes. This is from the Iliad, This is these are from the Song of Achilles, the book. But I did like little arts and crafts to make it look like all like worn down, kind of old map washed up on the beach vibe. And then laundry room. And then we're back, we're right back to where we started. That's my room. All my TikTok comments are like, room tour, room tour, please, please, can we get a room tour? So here it is, here's my room tour. Um, I hope you liked it. I like my room, except for this wall, obviously. It's a horrible wall, doesn't match at all. I've been collecting all of these things for years. I never throw anything away. I literally have stacks of old pictures, like, over there in case I just want to put them on my wall because you never know. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you want to, like if you want to, and then leave a comment if you want to, and watch another video. Yeah. Okay. Bye! Bye!